All right, we need to clear a path for the lieutenant here, please. Oh, how was she killed, Lieutenant? Excuse this guy. Out of the way, people. This guy here. Out of the way. You're here at 8 o'clock every morning? Excuse me. Thank you. Morning, Lieutenant. Uh, morning, Sergeant. What do you have? Well, the housekeeper found the body at 8 this morning, a few minutes after she arrived. The victim's in the bedroom. Her name is Marcy Edwards. Upstairs? Upstairs. Celebrity? Used to be. Ex-rock and roll singer. She was kind of famous for a while. What do you got, George? Looks like the lady and her friend were having a party. The way I figure, the lady changed her mind. The guy got persistent, and next thing, his fingers are on her throat. And a party. Oh, they're big. Guy must have had big hands. Okay, have the lab boys check these for prints. They look too smudged for an ID. Too smudged? Yeah, you could be right. Uh, what's her name? Marcy Edwards? Yeah. Did she sing a song, Closer, Closer, Your Lips to Mine? I don't know. Make love to me one more time? I don't know. Those are albums on the wall. I think that she was my nephew's favorite singer. Mm. He used to play that song over and over again. I think she's the one. What am I bothering with this for now? Something's wrong with me, George. Okay, any idea when this happened? My best guesstimate is yesterday afternoon, somewhere around 3 or 4 o'clock. Yesterday afternoon, somewhere around 3 or 4. Uh, yesterday was Wednesday? Yeah. They look good. They don't come any better, both bottles. Mm. What are you looking for, Lieutenant? Uh, the corks and that little metal thing that you find on champagne bottles. No, the bottles were opened in the kitchen, sir. How do you know that? Well, that's where we found the foil and the corks. In the kitchen? In the kitchen. Both corks? Both corks. What is it, Lieutenant? What's bothering you? I don't know why they open both bottles in the kitchen. One, I can understand. They open a bottle, they fill the glasses, they make a toast, they grab the bottle, and they take it to the bedroom. But after they finish the first bottle, why did they both come back to the kitchen to open the second bottle? Well, who says they did? One of them comes back to the kitchen, opens the second bottle, takes it back to the bedroom. I don't think that's the way people do it, because this is... Uh, Romantic situation and there's sex in the air and two people are drinking champagne together and they want to open a bottle together. They want to share the pop and the spritz. That's what champagne is all about. Pop and spritz. Why else do you drink champagne if not for the pop and the spritz? Jerry, would you take a picture of this corks and the foil? Sure. Mm-hmm. What do you think a thing like this cost? Cost? I don't know. It looks like a good one. Four, five hundred. Four, five hundred. Wow, these things, they go high. You want eight by tens, Lieutenant? Uh, that'll be fine, Jerry. You ever hear of Doty's discount? No, I don't think so. Yeah. I gotta check them. I hear they got good prices. You got a handkerchief? Uh, sure. Here you go, Lieutenant. Have the lab check these, but 
when they're through, get them back to me. Okay. Mind telling me what you expect the lab to find, Lieutenant? Oh, I don't know. Maybe nothing. <laughs> oh, Lieutenant. I found this in case of emergency notify card in Marcy's purse. I think it'd be better if you made this call. Why me? Well, I'm just a sergeant. I figure someone higher than me should break the news to a guy like this. You Crichton. The lawyer that never lost a murder case? That you Crichton? He's the one. Just one more thing. <laughs>